actually she does not tangle. I am really like blown away by that. <laughs> and welcome back to my channel. I upload at least a minimum of three days per week. My schedule pretty much varies and that's why you just need to join the party I've got going on here and click that subscribe button. Then you will get notified and not miss any of them. If you have already subscribed, thank you so very much. I greatly do appreciate it. I am gonna be bringing you another wig to review today. And of course, I'll tell you everything you need to know about her. Go down in the comments, give me your respectful feedback, and you can let me know too if there's a wig you'd like me to review, since I do take requests. But unfortunately, I do not have a stock card for this wig. I purchased her off of Poshmark and it just was not included, which you know can happen at times. But I've got a backup, my phone. <laughs> I looked it up online and I'm gonna read some of the uh, details about her off of my phone. So who I've got for you today is Volvo from Zurisis. She is a lace front and a human hair blend. I have her in the color Somme RT Cafe. And some of the details here is she is got a free part, flawless pre-tweezed hairline, and naturally blended edges. And she's also tangle free because she has anti-tangle hair technology. I've never heard of that before, but it sounds quite interesting and it also sounds quite promising. Plus she is also heat safe up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. And here she is. So the previous owner did wear her, therefore the lace has already been cut, but we're still gonna look at her inside cap construction. So here's what we got. So this is the lace area. So you can see that there is some space there for free parting. She has a comb here and a comb over here. Plus she does also have a comb in the back. Plus she has adjustable straps. Very nice lining. This is my favorite type of lining because you don't see any wefts. And oh, she stretches really, really nice too. So from the looks of it, she might be larger head friendly. I, of course, am gonna confirm it and tell you everything else when I come right back with my final thoughts. All right, everybody, I have returned. I'm also mentioning now in my videos what eyeshadow palette I'm wearing for my looks. And today I am wearing the Blue Blood Palette from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. That's it right here. However, on my lids and inner corners, I am wearing the shimmer shade from Ace Boutte. All right, so let's get back to the subject at hand, which is this wig. By the way, down in the description box, I did list a few places that I noticed she still is available at. Hopefully you can find her in the color you're looking for at one of those places. But I really love these straight sleek units. I do say that every time I wear them, I know, I get it, but it's so true. She is simple, she is classic, she is elegant. She is like the perfect everyday style in my opinion. So you can wear her no matter where you're going or what you are wearing. Plus, I think that she is a good headband wig. So put a headband on with her. I think that would be really adorable too. I absolutely love this cut. 
I would say she's probably between 22 and 24 inches based off of my height of five foot five. I love the layering, but even more than the cut, I think I like the density better. <laughs> I think it's perfect. That is one of the things I've noticed with the straight units lately is sometimes they can make them a little too thick and then it doesn't look very realistic. This, on the other hand, does look very realistic. So I'm loving this appropriate density that she has. And I'm really loving this beautiful color that she has too. So let me scooch in a little closer. So she starts off with the darker root, but just look at how it transitions and blends. That looks so professional and so beautiful. Plus you've got these gorgeous ashy tones blended in there. It's just stunning color. I really do like it a lot. And then there you can see her beautiful luster. That's another thing I like about the straight units. You can really see the luster and that healthy shine when I do that. Uh, I would say her texture is silky. Uh, she is feeling very soft, like it's healthy, deep conditioned hair. Uh, but she's definitely not feeling like doll hair, nothing like that. She still feels very realistic. And I do think that she is also multicultural. Well, let's go ahead and see her from the side and the back. All right, so um, I'm sure most of you are wondering, does she tangle? <laughs> I always tell you anyway, but this one's a little different because she has that anti-tangle hair technology. Actually, she does not tangle. I am really like blown away by that. <laughs> Very impressed. So you can see just how easy it is for me to run my fingers through this hair. Oh my gosh, same thing with a brush. I do come across a little bit of resistance, which is something I normally encounter with thicker units, but I'm thinking it's just because of that technology that they used. So it's not anything negative, but the fact that she doesn't tangle that is amazing. So she's not going to get frayed and damaged. She's going to last you like practically forever almost. And then it's so easy to manage. So go ahead, wear her down the back, wear her however you want to. So you don't have to worry about her getting messy or difficult to brush. I love that. Uh, she's not really shedding much either, but again, keep in mind, I did purchase her used. So it is very possible. She may shed a little bit more in the beginning, which is not that uncommon for wigs, especially the blonder ones. So just be prepared for that. But since she's not shedding now, I have no complaints in that department. <laughs> um, I did decide to go with a center part for her. So of course you can free part her if you like, but just keep in mind, you don't have a whole lot of area, but at least you have some versatility. And I like how flat she is laying. That is really nice. And the lace is easy to blend. So I'm not minding that whatsoever. And she does have a pre-tweezed pre hairline. So this is what that looks like. I mean, it's not the best in the world, but I can live with it. So it's still very easy to blend, which I do like. You can see right there. So... Again, not minding the sides all too much. And she's got some lift up here. Therefore, you might want to use some adhesive there, if you, uh, especially if you want to do different types of stylings with her. Uh, but she's fitting right above each ear nicely. She's also fitting very comfortably. And I actually do think that she is larger head friendly. This is a winner. Definitely a winner. She's kind of like a human hair dupe in a way. At least that's how I am feeling about it. I am so happy I did pick her up. I was kind of contemplating it when I first saw her, but I'm happy I did. This is so beautiful. So yes, I'm going to go ahead and give the thumbs up. Since she's still available, you can pick her up too. I definitely think you should. If you have her already though, I would like to know your thoughts on her. And I would also like to know if you're going to go pick her up after watching this review. That's all. Thank you so much for watching. I always appreciate it. And I will catch you next time in my next video. So until then, bye-bye.